countries held funding allocated by the national government will reach 2,311 million kina in 2023. It's 34% increase from 2021. Education will receive 1,650 million kina, a 51% increase from 2021. Law and justice will reach 1,787 million kina, a 41% increase from 2021. Treasurer Ian Lin Stucky says this is supporting the police recruitment campaign. In providing an update on the country's economy, the Treasurer went on to highlight the commitment made by the government to increase salary funding for a steady 5% increase of teachers and doctors and nurses through to 2027 and then 10% increase each year after that. Making sure that our new schools and hospitals will have the necessary staff. The economic sector will receive 989 million kina, a 46% increase from 2021, with a much greater focus on supporting our farmers and agriculture and SMEs. The Treasurer also stated that funding for provinces will increase to 5,138 million kina, a 30% increase from 2021. This gives governors more resources to implement their key activities at the decentralized level. However, there are challenges. The major challenge for the 2023 budget is now ensuring that this record level of funding is spent well and benefits our people. There is much work, much hard work ahead for all of us to ensure that this occurs. The 2023 budget is being delivered with a budget repair of a 1 billion reduction in the deficit. Lin Staki maintains that Papua New Guinea is doing better than most because of the government's economic policies.